Hello. All right, so I made my pet peeves list, and today I'm going to go through things that I really like. And there are more than 10 things on this list. There are 11 things on this list. I could have gone on longer than that, but video had been forever. Um, the first thing is that I love learning new things. I think it's pretty easy to see by now that I'm a huge geek and a nerd, so I love to learn new things, whether... Um, Generally, that's by reading, but a lot of the times it's, you know, watching biographies or talking to people or learning things hands-on, like museums and things. Uh, the second thing is I like to laugh a lot. Um, generally, I make jokes at my own expense, but luckily I get uh, a lot of material from other places. I'd like to say thank you right now to all my coworkers. You know who you are. Thank you for your material. Uh, the third is uh, that I like, <laughs> this is um, not so easy to admit, I like to be right. And I think most people enjoy being right, but I think I like being right um, a little too much sometimes. Because when I'm right, I generally do a little dance of victory. Uh, I'm big enough to admit that. Uh, the fourth thing that I like is naps. I usually sleep better in a nap than I do at nighttime. Um, and I usually sleep longer in naps than at night too, so maybe that's why I like them the best. Also, it's a good excuse for in the day, just being like, oh, I got a nap. It's my nap time. Gotta go. Although as an adult, it doesn't really work that great. <laughs> Gotta lay down from a nap. <laughs> People are like, you're strange. <laughs> yeah, they. Um, the fifth thing, and I should say this now, this is not in any order. It's just a thing that came to my mind. The fifth thing is books. I have, um... I have a small liking for books, you know, I like them okay, love them, love them. I have, uh, see, I did have a Borders card, when there was Borders I have a Barnes & Noble card, I have a um, Books A Million, and I'm going to be getting a card for The Strand. This is going to be the best, guys. I don't know where I'm going to put these books that I get, and I don't know how I'm going to purchase them, but I will find a way. Um, number six is coffee and tea. I must have at least one cup of coffee and one cup of tea a day to survive. I, seriously, ask anyone. I need them. It's important. Seven, um, which kind of could go along with, uh, number two. I enjoy making other people laugh. Um, again, a lot of times at my own expense. I have been known to do some rather silly things. To get a laugh and sometimes I say things that I don't intend to be funny but turn out to be humorous to others or I fall down and that's apparently hilarious and I'm bleeding and broken on the ground and I'm like <laughs> clumsy oaf and I'm like oh all for the laughter please take me to the emergency room uh, <laughs> number eight and this is just sad I like routines I like knowing that certain things are done a certain way every single time, all the time. And I will go out of my way to make sure that routine is completed in the right steps. Everything has to be in a certain order. Yes, I'm aware this is very OCD, but I enjoy that about my life. I, I like that a lot. And number nine, I like mysteries and crime dramas. Um, I like the really gory ones. Um, but I don't didn't realize they were gory, like Criminal Minds. I never thought about that as being particularly gory. Apparently is to some people. Um, but I like things that are talking about, you know, profiling and um, the psychology of the suspect. And, you know, the weirder the crime, the better. I like all that stuff. I think it's very fascinating. And it all goes into, you know, why do people do what they do? Again, learning new things. Um, and just kind of exploring things that I would never be able to do in real life, like, you know, I fantasize, oh, I could be a great detective. And then I think about, like, having to shoot someone. And I'm like, no, I'd totally wuss out. And I would just throw my gun at them ah, and run away. It would just be very embarrassing. Um, number 10, London. Love London. Love it. Went there, did not want to come back. And number 11 on my list is realizing how much easier it was to make a list of positive things as opposed to things that drove me crazy. And that made me feel really good because there is so much in the world um, to be thankful for and to think is awesome. I, I just watched a hilarious video with this kid dancing. Made me want to dance. 
So I should add dancing to my list. I mean, the list could go on and on. I think everyone should make their own list of things that they're grateful for and that they enjoy about life because you realize how many things you can come up with. And um, that's really the whole point of this video. That was it. Just to share some things about myself and maybe get you thinking about things that you enjoy. And I hope everyone's had a great Monday. Bye.